Oh, Robert Kubica. This one's hard to watch. Not because he's in, uh, he doesn't get hurt or anything like that. It's just tough. This is one of those wrecks where if you, if you, uh, you know, if you're new to the channel, make sure to like and subscribe. Um, you know, it's really helpful as I'm competing against major, major, mega channels. You can bet one of these two, if not both, they won't let me post. So, whatever. Um, but uh, I just posted Kevin Magnuson's shunt from the qualifying session. They are struggling, ironically, not with the rain, with the wind, as I said in the other video. So, with these onboard videos, I'll tend to go through. I have to give you a little bit of commentary, but I'm just going to keep it short. So, whatever. Um, the Japanese Grand Prix, yeah, Kubica is, uh, it's hard to watch because there's nothing he can do. And it's the, it's literally the first outlap. He's, it's Q1 and he's the first driver to go around and no, the cars are still in the garage and he just absolutely, uh, puts his car directly into the wall. It's at the same place K Mag dig, uh, can, approaching the control line. So he slows down. I think that's what screws him the most. He loses, uh, the tire, the the temperature in the tire, he hits these two chicanes with really no speed. He's setting himself up well, but you'll see him get on the grass and I'll pause it when he gets there. And he's like, he's, he's got to make a decision. And it's like, oh, if he moves too aggressive, I mean, I can feel for him. It's too late at this point. If he moves too aggressively back over, it's going to be a horrible wreck. So he's kind of got to ride it out and just accept it. But it's right there that it's over. I kind of think he knows it too. And you can see uh, it's just bang nothing you can do suspension so it's a pretty bad one and he definitely missed the rest of the session and you know you know, remember back to the last grand prix where he retired because of well they claim because of parts i don't know i'm not going to propose a controversy but or some conspiracy but um if it really is because of parts you got to wonder is he going to be back so um i'm still waiting to hear and then i'll post it over on the blog when i know anything and i'll give it to you guys let's go through it one more time and it's just it's tough to watch, and I'll move my ugly face and shut up so you can see it. But it's just, it's tough to watch because it's just over. You are like, there's nothing he can do about it. He's already made the mistake, but it really is just a flat out mistake. Uh, it is the wind caught him out, but it's still just a mistake. Him getting over on that grass. So I promise you to shut up, but I can't shut up too much, or they'll definitely block this. So, uh, yeah, he comes around the. Watch this entrance into uh, the finish line for the race. It's, he's just helpless. It's like he's going downhill. Um, so, yeah, it's it's it, all the drivers are struggling. It's not just him, but um, I'm not going to talk about uh, I'm not going to talk about qualifying because that'll save that for the actual video itself in case you don't actually care. But um, the times are low. It's just most of the field is struggling big time, especially the Renaults, the Williams, obviously, and Grosjean's actually driving well. So uh, make sure to check out the channel. I just posted a really um i'm really happy with it. i'm really proud of it i wish i had more time but i want to post it to you guys um, for the japanese grand prix but it's like a, a little mini film uh shorter documentary and um I, I go really deep on the japanese grand prix from 30 years ago not to the day but you get the point from 1989 the senna prost um controversy the first one at the japanese grand prix not the 1990s so I don't know if you know what you know about it, what you think you may know, and what else you can add to the story. But um, yeah, I figure I'd plug that in this in this little mini onboard. Go check out the Magnuson onboard, and I'll see you in like an hour and a half for the race. Make sure to watch it if you're not up, and if you are up, just not watching this, you missed out. Probably, I don't know yet; it hasn't happened. But I'll see you guys soon. Thanks for checking this out, guys.